We underestimated this technology as not only a rehabilitation device, but as a means for artistic expression. SciArt is a research lab that I direct uh, at the School of Media and Communication at RMIT. The lab consolidates research in interactive media art, games, design, and digital technology towards developing new applications in allied health-related disciplines. So the resonance table was originally conceived to assist patients with traumatic brain injury relearn basic movement skills. So the table is able to track the position of the user's fingers and also the objects that they place on the table. So my friend and colleague uh, James Hullock, who was a PhD student at the same time as myself, uh, came to see the interactive table and he conceived how it might be used as part of a performance he was developing with the Amplified Elephants. The Amplified Elephants are an ensemble for sound artists with an intellectual disability uh, and it was initiated by the Footscray Community Arts Centre and James Hullock in 2006. It seems pretty straightforward and that's the interesting part about how this whole thing is working. The relationship is about uh, intuitive interfaces and intuitive sound making processes. It's not really about trying to make things too tricky or um, techno clever. The interface that is the sort of resonance table is um, it's a much more elegant kind of interface than the sort of interfaces we used before. So it sort of gives the elephants in particular another um, layer or level of um, intuitive, interactive music making. Yeah. Uh, I first met Nikki through James. Um, Nikki is the producer for the Amplified Elephants. I think often um, with the kind of music that the Amplified Elephants do with that project, it's um, experimental music and people often come to us and say, I'm not sure what that was about, what's the story behind that piece of music, which is a really interesting thing for me because I think when we go to a concert we don't often ask those questions, but when it's just sound, people start asking those questions, what does it mean for me? When they see, they, when they are able to see what is happening, I, don't, I think those questions will be answered. It'll just be about, I want to play with it myself. Yeah, I think I was excited to see it become more than what we'd originally developed it for. So to see it being performed by musicians, in front of an orchestra was beyond our wildest expectations of what we thought it could be used for. As living systems, living systems, IV networks, IV networks, interacting, interacting, in network fashion, in network fashion.